So yeah, um, on my way to my very, very, very first wild camp, urban stealth camp, whatever you want to call it. Um, in fact, it's my first time camping for years. I can't remember the last time we went. But yeah, we're on the bike. Um, just on our way up now. It's not far from where I live. Uh, not a bad evening. We've just had a little bit of a downpour, but that's passed. Um, so yeah, I'll uh, come back when we get a bit closer. Uh, yeah, so we're not far away now. Um, on the outskirts of Huddersfield in West Yorkshire. Um, I feel like a bit of a wally with my bike. I've got the big rucksack on there. <laughs> panniers are loaded up tent hanging out the side there only going for one night I'll be back in 12 hours um, but yeah it's not a bad evening at all um, this is Huddersfield right so that there is where we're spending the night this is the M62 motorway and that is a roundabout covered in a little woodland that's in the middle of the slip road to get off it. You see a car coming off there. So we just need to get a bit further down this road and we'll try and cross over and try and get in there without looking too much like a weirdo. get off and push here <sighs> bit dodgy this bit so we'll cross onto this little traffic island here need to wait for all the cars to do one and we can uh, make a run for it so to speak so yeah we're going up there let's just do it oh no there's another one coming and another one and another one I should have set off a bit later maybe Let's go. Can't ride up this bit. It's very, very rough. Also, this bike weighs a ton when you're pushing it. But these trees are quite thick, so once we're in, there's nobody seeing us. So here we are. We're not staying in this bit. But yeah, there's the road. Here's the wood. We need to get through there, which you can, because I came up the other week. And it sort of opens out further, close to the motorway. And it's... Uh, yeah, it looks all right, but we'll see See now anyway. Came up the other week here, I rode past it and just always sort of wondered what was on here. And uh, as it turns out, it's, uh, there's quite a bit. But best of all, there's no people, no dog walkers, not really any litter other than what's blown off the motorway. Yeah, a lot of nettles and brambles and uh, I'm in shorts. Probably not the best idea. Keep going. Oh, I'm getting stung. Oh, yes. Oh, it's all good fun. Jeez. Oh, 
Yeah, there was a. Well, it was over, over there, I think, where I saw the flat bit. But we'll put the bike somewhere, and I'll have a wander round, I think, and see if there's anywhere else. So this looks reasonably all right, I think. It's sort of half flat, I suppose. It's, it's not too bad. Yeah, weird places like this. They're, they're dotted about all over the place, but you can, you know, I've probably driven past this hundreds, thousands of times even. Never seen it, never been in here. I think there's no sort of footpaths, there's no litter. I don't think anybody really ever comes in here. It's, uh, yeah, you've got the slip road there that runs all the way around, all the way up there, all the way up there. So it is, there's no footpaths on the slip road, so you can't, there's, there's just not any reason for anybody to come in here. Yeah, so I think that'll be home for the night. Right, so that's, that's me all set up. It's uh, our little spot here, so with trees all around the back there. Let's leave the bike against the tree. It's an electric mountain bike, so I'll probably just bring the battery in so it don't get too cold. I don't know how cold it's going to be tonight. I think forecast says three, four degrees, so nothing silly. Uh, yeah, so we'll look inside. It's all cheap camping gear, this. It's all Amazon home bargains. We've just got a little foil mat on the ground, then there's this inflatable sleeping mat, uh, sleeping bag. Brought another pillow. There is one, there's a pillow on the mat, but I find it a bit uncomfortable. Yeah, it does make you nervous, but I won't give these things a go. I'm not getting any younger. Um, so yeah, I did when I came up here the other week. There were some little sort of holes around the base of trees. I'm presuming critters live in there. I don't know. Presume rabbits. Who knows? Yeah, it's not a bad little spot. This. It would be, I'm sure, if the motorway wasn't there, it would be packed with people. I don't think anybody down there will be able to see us. They're all looking straight ahead. They're not looking to the side of them. This old shoe there. Don't know how long that's been there. A bit of moss growing on it. Lovely. Yeah, this is just some little, uh, like, uh, um, what are we? Calm a vegetable. Subtly, very subtly spiced curry, apparently. Uh, it's just some home bargains thing. So, little packet rice to uh, to throw in with it as well. I don't even think I'll eat it all, to be fair. I'm not massively hungry, but... Mm. There you go, look. Food of champions. I don't reckon this will look that much different 
when it comes back out. There you go. Smells all right. Still got a fair bit of traffic down there, but it'll quieten down. It's starting to get dark now. Another half hour or so. Should be dark. Move my bike round here. I've taken the battery off. Still, it's not feeling as spooky as I thought it was going to feel. Well, not yet, anyway. The weather forecast said it was going to be like not freezing tonight. There's been a frost. It's last day of April, and there's been a frost pretty much every morning in April. It's, it's like nearly May. I should be scraping my car to go to work in the morning. But yeah, it, it feels like it could be quite chilly again tonight. It's dropping off now that it's uh, now that it's getting dark. Uh, just having a bit of a wander. It is getting properly dark now. I never really gave any thought that motorway's got street lights on it, and they'll be on all night. So it's not going to be. Pitch black, I don't think, in here. Uh, it has slowed down a bit now. It's still there's still a fair bit of traffic on it, but it's uh, time is it just after nine, ten past nine, something like that. There's no like birds, can't hear any bird noise, whether that's just because of the traffic noise or they're already called it a day. Who knows? So we're ooh what ten quarter past ten ish now. Um, it is dark. It has got fairly that really cold. I think we might be waking up to a bit of frost in the morning. The weatherman um, lied again. Never mind. Um, so yeah, I think I'll call it a night now and be back in the morning. I'll be well, so good night. See you tomorrow. Good morning. So, about, uh, it's about half past five, and about, so I've been awake for probably about 45 minutes now. <coughs> uh, birds are making a lot of noise outside. It's light, um, feels quite cold. It's been a weird night, the sort of temperatures have been really up and down. Um, a couple of hours ago it did, it, it got really mild and then it dropped off again. But it is what it is. Um, slept alright. Um, sort of traffic noise wasn't too bad really. Um, so yeah, get the stove on, have a coffee I think. Uh, I'm not, I don't usually bother with breakfast and I won't be doing that today either, so yeah, I'll have a coffee. Um, look at getting out of here and getting back home. Not a bad morning. Yeah, just kept the bike in front of the tent last night. No need, it wasn't going to walk anywhere, but made me feel a bit better. 
So, we'll get some water boiling. Still a bit nippy. Well, yeah, so apart from the traffic, which um, it did die down, but you still get a lot of lor lorries thundering past. Um, there's going to be quite a few cars as well that are going past with like loud, like really, really loud music. Um, so they're leaving the motorway, coming down this slip road and the, the wood that we're on is completely surrounded by it so you can just hear the music travelling all the way around. It just seems to go on forever. But yeah, I had half a decent night's sleep. So it got a bit too cold, this sleeping bag, it's only really a two season sleeping bag this. Um, so, lesson for next time. Oh, next time we come out we'll make sure it's a bit warmer. So, I'll have this and we'll think about um, pack it up, getting out of here. Right, so that's me. We're packed up. Uh, to where we were, just sort of here. Um, there's nothing left behind. Bikes all packed up over there. Um, I don't live very far away, so I'll be home in 10, 15 minutes. So if you enjoyed watching that, please subscribe, please like it, please leave a comment. I will read them. This is a it's a brand new channel, so I'm starting from scratch. No subscribers, no views, nothing. Um, so we'll just see how it goes. If people like them, I'll do some more. I mean, I'm going to come out and do some more. But whether I've, I'll video it if people want to watch them. I'll video it. If they don't, I might still video it anyway, but we'll see how that goes. Um, so yeah, if you are watching, thank you for watching. And uh, look out for the next one. And if you fancy having a go at this yourself, just do it, just go and buy some gear, it's not expensive, you don't have to spend a fortune on camping gear, you can if you want, but there's really no need if you're only away from home for a night. Um, yeah, just, just, just have a go, get out there and try it. So I'm going to make my way home now and uh, thank you very much, I'll see you on the next one.